smallest robot in the competition in terms of height. I'll tell you what, they aren't doing badly to stay. Oh, left of that attack now. In after nuts. From Hampshire, nuts to. Nuts now reaches a top speed of 20 miles an hour and will spin at 540 RPM. The boys say being attacked by nuts will be like being hit by a sledgehammer 18 times a second. From central London, Rapid. Team Rapid run a research and development engineering firm with offices around the world. Rapid costs £25,000 to make and the team say can flip a transit van and meter in the air. From Intrum, Northern Ireland, Jellyfish. Team captain Dave is a writer and wife Gemma is a horse dentist. They built jellyfish to absorb damage with its high density polyester armour. From Oxford, Terahertz. 16 years in development, Terahertz is back. Team captain John Reed is a design engineer and teammate Nick is a rocket scientist. Their CO2 powered axe develops a ton of force. The house robot for this battle is the delicious Matilda. Swipe left or she'll take a swipe at you. Weighing in at a trim of 350 kilos. Roboteers, stand by. I can't wait for this. The team's in the control booths. It's battle time. Three, two, one. Activate. I love the smell of the Robot Wars Arena in the morning. Oh, and in the media, jellyfish is up in the air. The lowest, smallest robot in the competition in terms of height. The flailing chains of nuts. A three meter diameter on that fearsome weapon. Jellyfish in trouble. Come on, Jelly. Dave Laurie at the controls with Gemma alongside him. They'll try and clamp and hold on and hold on to their reasoning and hold on to a place in the competition. I'll tell you what, they aren't doing badly to stay. Oh, left of that attack there. Mighty blow from the terahertz. And the little cluster bots are out there as well, belonging to the nuts team. There we see Rapid in underneath and flipping jellyfish into the air. Rapid with that incredible flipper. Well armoured too. 15 times more powerful than any other flipper ever built. But, where are they in the competition now? In after nuts. Turning, spinning, control problems. Oh, 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 oh. What about this? Oh, Matilda. Don't mess with the rear end of Matilda. Oh, it's a grisly place to be. And that's a doomed place to be. Nuts. Oh, the nutty boys. Out. One robot forlorn and forgotten. Three remain. A little cluster bots of nuts are still out there, trying to create nuisance value more than anything else. No, no, no more firing. No more firing. That mighty axe of terahertz, the experienced John Reed in there. And here we have terahertz chasing after Rapid. They're leaving Jellyfish alone because they think Jellyfish is immobilised and spinning awkwardly, but going nowhere. This is all about the damage now The Terahertz can cause. On Rapid, thinking about later in the competition, good planning, good tactics here by John Reed. Cease is called. Justed enough, probably. Nice. Just. Oh, guys. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. <laughs> One booth buoyed by victory, one booth beaten. The attack on Jellyfish, I think, damaged the controls there. They were never really active on those dirt bike tyre treads. And you can see there Nuts having problems with the controls. And that onslaught from Matilda ended their dreams. Rafa, you should be very happy with this, presumably. OK. Yeah, okay. you got under some, but didn't get under others. Well, it's a balance between getting it low enough and not getting caught on every screw at the bottom of the arena. Yeah. So we've got to find that balance. And at one stage, though, you had a chain under, uh, caught in your mouth. Yeah. Eating it. However, there was a significant part of the bout where you were running away backwards from this <laughs> lot. You did very, very well there. Nice little driving test, that was. Were you happy with how the axis turned? No. Really? It's dying on power, very limited. No, it's not happy at all, so we'll have to look at that. Nonetheless, you're through. Rapid and terahertz. Well done to both of you. Well done, guys. Well done. <laughs> it's an early exit for friends turned rivals, nuts and jellyfish. But John has expertly driven terahertz into the next round. Oh, it's the 
He now has two hours in the pits to fix that axe. The axe mechanism is really, really stiff. It looks like we're going to have to disassemble, strip the whole machine down to its base and look at the ram, look at the inside of the ram, see what we've got. Rapid managed to coast this group stage nearly intact. Bent our front fork, but otherwise we should be able to bend that and that one's come off a bit. We can add some weld onto that. 